Microsoft and Sony show no signs of ending their epic console feud, which means game-hungry fans probably won't have to wait very much longer for an Xbox 2. But what should we expect? Hit that subscribe button now to become part of the Tech Info Warrior family. Let's see if we can get up to 100 likes on this video and don't touch that dial. My prediction for the release date of the Xbox 2 will either be 2018 or 2019. Stay tuned and I'll tell you why that is. There's no definitive Xbox 2 release date yet because Microsoft hasn't formally unveiled any plans for a new console, but it's almost certain that Microsoft is looking at a new model to take on Sony's inevitable PlayStation 5. Also, it's important to remember that the pace of game console launches is quickening. The original Xbox was first released in 2001, followed by the Xbox 360 in 2005. We then had to wait 8 years for the Xbox One. But things have changed, the Xbox One S came in 2016, just 3 years after its predecessor. And the brand new Xbox One X launched in 2017, a mere year after the console it replaced. Sony is playing at a similarly frantic tempo with its own console releases, because both companies have realised that they can mimic the smartphone sales model offer a few performance upgrades and convince some gamers to upgrade every year or two. Based on previous PlayStation launches, the PS5 looks likely to arrive in 2019. If this happens, Microsoft will almost certainly debut a new console within a year of Sony's reveal. Of course, there's no guarantee that Microsoft will keep pace with Sony or even the company's own rapid release pace. If I had to guess, I'd say expect a new console in 2019. The month will almost certainly be November, as every previous generation Xbox model, except the One S, has been launched in November too. Ready for those lucrative Christmas sales giving potential customers and family members of Xbox fans time to buy one in for themselves or as a gift. Microsoft's Xbox One X is already on a really strong footing. It can play video games at native 4K resolution and can play 4K Blu-ray discs. The latter feature is missing on the PS4 Pro. So what should we expect? Well. The good news is that Microsoft is already working on the next Xbox as of July 2017, according to Windows Central Jez Corden. The obvious big improvement will be in terms of performance. Now that the Xbox One X is capable of 4K gaming, Microsoft will be keen to improve graphical fidelity and frame rate. It's also possible that Microsoft will produce three versions of the Xbox, a premium, supercharged model and a cheaper, less graphical intense version for casual gamers. Microsoft also faces the obvious gap of VR and AR. Sony doubled down on virtual reality with its PlayStation VR platform, but Microsoft hasn't made any noise about VR for the Xbox. However, Microsoft has long been working with the HoloLens augmented reality headset, which lets you overlay virtual objects onto your real-world environment. It's likely that Microsoft will be looking at ways of integrating its HoloLens AR technology into a future Xbox, although nothing is confirmed on that front yet. Microsoft will probably debut its new console with some launch exclusives too, so count on a new Halo game turning up alongside the next generation Xbox. Finally, we could see the bridging of the gap between Xbox and Windows 10. Microsoft offers gaming on both systems, so it makes sense to try and unify the platforms going forward. It's too early to say exactly what the Xbox 2 price will be, but we can take a guess based on previous Xbox launches. The most recent console was the Xbox One X, which landed at a very high £449.99. That's way higher than the PS4 Pro's £349, so Microsoft may be keen to undercut its rival Sony, but we'd be surprised. Microsoft will probably charge somewhere between £349 and £499 for its next console, but there's no way of really knowing right now. Just to mention, I've recently started a Patreon page, so if you'd like to be one of the first to show your support, there's a link down in the description. So please support the channel by dropping a like and subscribing so that you don't miss some very big videos coming very soon. And trust me, you don't want to miss them. So please do become part of the Tech Info Warrior family. Thanks for watching, I hope you enjoyed this video, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye for now.